So apparently, there is a secret area inside of the new Doors Retro Floor that they just added for the April Fool's update. And apparently, you're able to still make your way through all 100 doors inside of Retro Mode. And that last final area where you get the badge isn't actually the end of the floor. So today, we're going to be finding out if this is true or not. And if it is, I'm actually going to end up showing you guys how to do it too. So as always, smash that like button, hit subscribe, check out the demon merch, which is linked down below in the group description too. Come on and get this demon drip. You know you want to look like me. All right, but here we are inside of Retro Mode. I kind of wish they added like the little loading title screen when we load into here, just like how there is inside of the back door in the rooms. Yo, imagine if the Seek and Figure Morphs actually chased after you inside of this mode. That would be terrifying. All right, but the Draco Blockers are gonna arrive in 600 seconds. And also, I'm pretty sure you guys just do not want to see me make my way all the way through here because you probably want to figure out if this secret is true or not as much as I do. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, Ghost Rush just came out of nowhere. Oh, you know what? I'm just, I'm just gonna speed ahead, okay? And I'm, I'm just gonna show me sweating the obbies. All right, here we go. The first obby, the infamous Seek Wall. Oh, and he's already red and angry. Bro is already on his way. But uh, I've actually figured out how to easily no diff this part of the new retro mode. And look at this. I'm about to no diff this. Easy peasy. I'm just too good. I'm just too good at these things. You see that wall over there? Nah, I'm gonna keep going. Take my way over here. Cut the corners. All right, we're chilling. Seek is angry again, but he's and coming back. All right, but watch this, guys. I'm about to no diff this next part too. The wall is coming back. All right, go, 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 go. This is literally so easy. This is just too easy. This is just too easy. See, hole in the wall there? Nah, I'd win. Okay, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. All right, look at that. Easily no diffed it. Light work, no reaction. I definitely did not die, and I definitely did not restart and end up at half health this time. I told you guys, I'm the door's expert. I'm the door's pro. Okay, but now we're on to the second obby. What is the correct path? Let me get lucky here. Okay, it's not yellow. How about blue? How about blue? Okay, it's not blue. Hello? All right, but about to no diff this obby too. This is also light work, no reaction. I honestly don't know how you guys needed them to literally buff the obby. Like any true Roblox veteran, i.e. myself, I started playing in 2011, guys. Anyone can do this. These are the simplest of the simple. Look at this. I'm already at the end. I'm already at the end. And then the ball jumps are easy, too. You can literally just skip them easy. All right, bring on the third obby. I'm ready. I literally have a whole 300 seconds remaining. I'm chilling. Look at this dude. Look at this dude. He can't even stop me either. Get him out of here. All right, third obby time. Here we go. We got a little bit over two minutes on the clock but i'm about to know if this one too but seriously how did you guys suck so bad on the trust jumps that they had to nerf it the trust jumps were actually fine all you have to do is bunny hop you just go back and forth left and right bro get out of here okay but i really want to get to that winners area before the boss battle music starts playing because even though they cannot affect us after we win they are just ungodly annoying like let's just all agree that music is annoying it's right path yellow no right path blue no all right bet okay, here we go literally two minutes on the clock Oh, we're so close to the end. And then we're going to be able to find out if this secret is true or not, guys. Oh, imagine if we can actually keep going after the winner's area. What kind of monsters would be spawning? What would be going down in there? Okay, I just fell. All right. All right, here we go. I told you guys it was a light work. Literally 45 seconds on the clock. Okay, just... Please don't mess up on this last thing. I do not want to restart again. Oh, Screech, get out of here. Okay, but here we go. Here we go. We're at the final door, and we made it out. Everyone's celebrating. It's a party. Okay, except for this dude. He's dead. Okay, I don't know what happened to him. But guys, now that we're at the final winner's area, we're at the end. Okay, well, the music is just still going even though I'm here. Okay. It is now time to see if we can actually access a secret area in here. Oh my god, they are growling at me. Okay, I am just... Just, uh, turning them down. But apparently what you're supposed to do is get the 100 speed, and then you make your way carefully all the way over to this area, and then if you can glitch it, you can actually jump on top, and then you jump on the next one, and then you jump onto this sign, which then jump onto the wall. Okay, I gotta be so careful. I am so speedy right now. I'm barely tapping my W button, and I'm moving so much. Okay, hi, Screech. But, oh, what is that over there? Okay, hold on. Let me, let me go over here. Wait, is that the secret area? Do I just need to jump and grab it? Is that what we do? Is that even possible? Okay, hi, Screech. Okay, but guys, it looks like there actually is a secret area. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna try and jump to it. Hopefully, I do not die in the void. All right, let's try and MLG plays this. Come on. Okay, I'm on top of it. No! 
I got glitched back. Okay, I need to try and open the door jumping onto it. Oh, this is actually so hard to control. I move so fast. Up here again. Run over here. Okay. Okay, here we go, guys. Second time's the charm. Second time is the charm. Do I just need to grab the door? Do I just need the... Okay, I think I grabbed it. I think I grabbed it. No, but I died. Wait. Oh, but I can still revive? Wait, hold on. Hold on. Do we get in? Did we get in? Oh, we got in! No! It's door 44! And guys, the event door ends at 43! But we're at door 44! Wait, hold on. Is there a full 100 doors in here? Alright, you guys already know what to do. If you've made it this far in the video, smash that like button, hit subscribe. And now it is time for us to venture through here and see if we can find anything secret. I think the lights just flickered. Okay. Wait, is an entity actually on its way? Are they still gonna be coming through? Okay, yep, I can hear Rush. Oh! Rush came through, but the lights didn't break. What? Okay, interesting. So I guess we're just casually breaking the game. Okay, but hold on. We're almost at door 50. Is there gonna be like figure in here? Is the figure mesh gonna be walking around? Oh, there's door 50 right there. Okay, no, it's just it's just another generic room. Okay, and Screech showed up. All right, but what secrets are hiding around here? What secrets wait for us? Are the Draco blocks gonna end up spawning in here too? Okay, that would kind of suck if they start chasing after me and I have to make my way through here. Can I even hide from them inside of closets okay i'm getting a lot of screeches though oh my god oh no the draco blocks are here run okay okay but yep eyes eyes is here too okay oh but imagine if there was like a retro version of the gardens once we get down to door 90 through 100 oh found a lighter all right 67 68 <laughs> 69 I noticed that there is not a lot of the normal entities moving through here besides Screech and Eyes. I have not gotten a second rush ever since that first one, and I have also not gotten an ambush. I'm just getting spammed with eyes at this point. Let me find out. Every room I go in is about to have eyes in it. Yep, well, would you speak of the devil? Okay. Okay, but here we go. We're getting into the 80s. How far does this new retro area go? What is the limits on it? Aw, oh, imagine if it just doesn't stop at door 100. Watch it be like the rooms. It goes all the way to 8000 or something. I wonder if there's any other entities inside of retro mode that are hidden. Like, like Dread inside of the normal hotel. Imagine if you could go to the rooms and the back door on retro mode. That would be cool. Okay, but we're entering the 90s now. Oh, we're about to be at door 100. Will we get a secret badge? Door 96? Door 97? Door 98? 99? And there it is. Door 100. What happens here? All right, here we go. Here we go. I have no clue what's about to happen from the other side of this door. Okay, and Screech and Eyes are still trying to kill me. Okay, you know what? We're opening it. Okay, huh? Oh, wait. 101. Oh. Oh, why did it just fall into the void? What? Wait, what is this? Does it just stop here? What? It just stops at 101? What am I supposed to do now? Do I, like, need to jump up and, like, hardcore onto the roof or something? I... Oh, no. Okay, guys. Well, I have no clue what I need to do now. So, my only resolution is to jump out this door and into the void. So, uh, real quick, make sure to smash that like button, hit subscribe, and comment down below for more Doors videos. Wait, can I not even, like, walk out? Hello? Okay, nah, I just... Okay, I get glitched.